Hey guys, it's Kelsey Louise here, and I just want to make this video um, really as quick as possible. Just get this information out to you. This is going to be a comparison of um, ClickFunnels, Kajabi, and a little bit about Kartra, and I'll tell you why it's only a little bit about Kartra uh, instead of a more thorough experience of it. Uh, so first of all, this review and comparison is for uh, people who have a digital product that they want to sell online through a course, a membership site, uh, or some online course that they're creating and wanting to sell and bring members on into. So this could be, uh, you know, coaches, um, consultants, professional services, if you have that online course that you're selling. I was with ClickFunnels for about a year and a half. And, um, I think they're, they're, I mean, they're great. They're, the ones who really kind of started it all. They're kind of the big name brand, maybe the biggest name brand for funnels, for sales funnels and getting your marketing and kind of putting it all together. And you can also host your webinars and have your membership sites all on there. Uh, so I'll tell you, all three of these programs can absolutely do all of those things. They're all considered all-in-one programs. They just have their different strengths and their features that are more of the focus for those individual companies. So I think for ClickFunnels, the sales funnel is their biggest feature. Uh, I, However, I don't think at this point it's any better whatsoever than Kajabi or Kartra. Uh, or even other landing page funnel sites like lead lead pages, I think is what it's called. It's the other one. I, I've done a couple of test ones on there, but I've never used it fully because um, it's not so all in one. And I was looking for something more, more all in one. First of all, real quick, I'm not going to do any screen sharing on this. I was thinking about it. I'm not going to. I want to get this out as quickly as possible, uh, in part because Kajabi has some crazy good deals going on right now. So I want to get this video made and out there and get you guys access to those deals. Um, so you can start testing out the platforms for yourself. So I was with ClickFunnels about a year and a half and it's, it's, it's the base model. It's the biggest name. It, it's kind of where you start if you're familiar with like internet marketing, um, for online courses. Um, my first three months of using it, I had so many literal moments of pulling my hair. It drove me crazy. I thought it was incredibly clunky and not very responsive, not intuitive. I had a lot of troubles with integrations, with getting it to connect to different programs. The uh, email campaign software that I was using, originally I was connecting it to Infusionsoft and then having to use Zapier to connect it to that because it wouldn't integrate with the webinar platform. If you're outsourcing an to a different platform like Webinar Jam or Evergreen, EverWebinar, um, then that's different. They connect differently that way. But if you're trying to do the in-house webinar system through ClickFunnels, it's just a pain. It is a nightmare to try and get all of those to communicate and connect. So eventually I got it figured out. Uh, eventually completely lost my mind with Infusionsoft. Um, that drove me crazy. And I ended up switching to ConvertKit, which is honestly quick little side review about that. I don't think at this time there's any other email campaign platform that can do as much as Infusionsoft can. I think the the tagging and segments and really specific marketing that Infusionsoft can do is pretty much unmatched. Kartra is saying that it's getting up there. Um, it's trying to be able to replace that. I don't know if it can do that or not. I'm not sure. Maybe it can, and that'd be really cool. <clears throat> but unless you have, I don't know, a lot of time to figure out Infusionsoft or are only doing the basic stuff on there, or you have somebody on your team who takes care of it for you, it's honestly so much of a headache. I, I won't go back unless I need to, until I need to. But unfortunately, ConvertKit is such the extreme, the other direction, where it's so basic and it's so simple, it can't do... Uh, like rudimentary tagging and segments. And it's, it's, it's too far the other way of an extreme of not being able to do a lot of things that I needed to do. So I don't like either of those programs. Uh, just as an aside. So there's going to be people who maybe watch this video and completely disagree with everything that I say and say, no, ClickFunnels is hundred percent the best. Kartra absolutely can do everything or whatever. That's completely okay. That's what's so cool about this is that there's competition because all of these platforms are so similar in their features and what they offer and really what they can do. It's just a tool. 
you're the person behind it who's actually going to make it into something. This is just a tool to help you get there. So don't spend more than a day figuring out which one of these you want to use. Don't waste your time being like, I have to use the right one. This has to be the right program. No, that's not, there's really no such thing. I will tell you that Kajabi is hands down 100% my absolute favorite. And I'll tell you why doesn't mean it's the right one. It doesn't mean it's going to have all the features that you want, all the things that you want. So go out there. And part of the reason why I'm not going to do screen sharing is because it's going to take you five minutes to Google all three of these sites, which I believe after doing my due diligence, that these are the top three to compare between. Um, <clears throat> you can look at all the, the different ones. There's dozens um, of different platforms and software programs that work to be able to create this online course, funnel, marketing, emails, webinars, hosting, all of it together. These are the top all-in-ones, in my opinion. So go to their websites, check them out, see what they look like and what you think about them to really make that decision for yourself. I'm going to run through how I made my decision for myself. Um, so ClickFunnels made me want to pull my hair out. I kind of accepted that it's just where my platform was. It's what I had. And I, and I left it there and I stayed for a year and a half. I hated that every single time I needed to edit something in my membership platform, it would pull up the edit screen and it would literally shake like this as I'm sitting there trying to edit it. And I, I've tried on multiple different computers and not understanding why I can't it load properly. Um, I, I felt, I mean, it, I felt it was so clunky and old school and just really outdated. It looks very outdated to me. Um, I did not at all like the flow of the way it set up the funnels that it communicated with the other integrations that it worked with. It simply felt very, these are my words, clunky and old to me. So, um, I started looking into alternatives. What else could I do? And I had a new coach recommend Kajabi. I had never heard of Kajabi before. I was like, I've heard of Kartra before and that's a new one. They just did the launch, Frank Kern, who is this brilliant internet marketer. So I was checking that out. So what I decided to do was uh, enroll in the two week trial for both of those programs for Kajabi and Kartra. So I signed up for both of them and I started essentially just committing to both to test it and to see what I thought. So I started inputting in all of my information, seeing how easily could I transfer over my membership site? Um, what could I, how could I transfer my, my website? Cause my website's really just a landing page with static pages attached to it. You know, I don't have a separate website and maybe you do, maybe you have a separate website and you use WordPress for your membership site and all of these things. And if you love that, sorry, my puppy's hitting the tripod. Um, then that's great. Then stay there. But if you're not in love with the program that you're using right now, or if you're just starting out, then this is kind of the stuff that you need to help you make that decision. Um, <clears throat> and I completely recommend like go on, sign up for both the trials, test it, give it a try, test the trials, see which platform you love, how it operates, and then just cancel the one you don't. Uh, so why I don't have a lot to say about Kartra is because whereas I love the concept behind it, I think they're the ones really trying to launch this as full of an all-in-one as absolutely possible by really, really experienced people. And it's very cool. I made it about a day <laughs> into my trial and I got so frustrated. It felt like ClickFunnels all over again, just a slightly newer version, a little more polished. I, I hated the way that it moved around. It didn't feel intuitive. Um, I just, I didn't like I simply didn't like how it functioned. I didn't like the way it communicated and and moved around from one thing to the others. I, I didn't think it, it made sense the way that the funnel connected to the emails that were integrated in there. I don't know, as personal preference, that's why you really have to test it for yourself. Because what I can tell you is when I went on to my Kajabi trial, within three days, three days, I had my entire website and my landing pages and my static pages transferred over. I had my sales funnel, the one I was still um, wanting to use and transfer over, and my entire membership course platform with 45 videos, text downloads, audio files, images, everything. <laughs> Three days, completely set up, operational. <laughs> And so, okay, I didn't do that alone because that wasn't the only thing I was working on. I actually hired a guy from Fiverr because um, right now at this time of my business, I'm, it's, it's really just me and freelancers. Uh, I'm a big proponent of once you hit a certain level, hire employees and all of that. 
I'm just not at that level yet. So this is my experience as as a somewhat beginner. You know, I'm, I'm just moving into my second year of business. Um, so I use freelancers and really when I have an amazing experience with one of them, I want to be able to share that. There's a guy on Fiverr. I'll put his name below. If you are doing anything switching over to Kajabi, if you're really anxious about that, if you're like, I, I have my membership site and I don't like the platform and I'm really ready to switch to something that's new and beautiful and sleek and looks elegant and fits my brand and all of these things. And I want to transfer it over, but that sounds like so much work and I don't have employees yet. Well, then that's exactly the boat that I was in. And um, this guy is just fantastic, fantastic with Kajabi, knew exactly what he was doing. It was so cool. So he did all of that transferring. And while he was doing that, I was setting up my entire marketing funnel, a brand new one, setting up to a webinar. Now for this webinar, I did a pre-recorded one that I scheduled to air one time and then do a replay set at specified times. You can also set it up to be evergreen, so it's constantly going, or you could do a live. Uh, I believe all three of these platforms have all of those capabilities. For me, what stood out was that with Kajabi, in these three days, it I mean, it felt, it was so easy it was so intuitive. It was so seamless. It was completely elegant. Everything looked gorgeous. It looked exactly the way that I envisioned it in my mind. And it was like, even with as much customization as I did on ClickFunnels and Kartra, I could not make it look like my brand. It didn't look like the, the elegant style that I wanted. It just, it didn't, it didn't feel right. To me so that's so much of it comes down to just simply what they all have such similar features so to which one do you feel connected with do you feel is easy to use because how are you supposed to teach a team to replace you to to be able to run this site and platform and the marketing and everything for you if you're not even comfortable with it if if it's this anxiety ridden thing or this is really difficult big thing to like get on whatever your platform is and work on it so I, I just am a huge believer that whatever platform you're using needs to be really comfortable for you. And the easiest way I can describe this is about six months ago, I switched for the first time in my life. I've always been a PC person. Um, I switched my laptop, which is what I, this is my husband's desktop that I use for some things, but I primarily do 95% of my work on my laptop. And I've always been PC and I just switched over to Mac. And I was just so nervous about it because it's a whole new operating system. I've never used it before. I really wasn't sure what that experience was going to be like. And it, <laughs> it changed my life. It was amazing. Anybody who's been through that before, you know what I'm talking about. It flows. It feels seamless. It feels easy. It feels intuitive. Not everyone agrees with that. Some people say they've tried it and they've hated it and they go back and they love PC. They love the customization of PC. And this is exactly like what I feel like these programs are. A Kajabi to me feels like Mac. It's all kind of smooth and, and all of them have, how do I say this? All of them have done for you programs. You can go in to their funnel pages and they'll pop it up. Everything's populated in there for you. Images, placements, emails, where they go, what to say in the emails, the copy's already in there. All three of these programs have done for you services. It's very cool. You can use that. Honestly, though, in, these business, in this business, what makes us stand out is being unique. So using your own voice and your own language is crucial. However, the seamless connection and the way that things move and operate to me on Kajabi feels the same with the intuitive ability as using a Mac does. And things like ClickFunnels and Kartra to me just felt a lot like, like using a PC. And like you can do a lot more customization to it. It has, I feel like, a lot more options. Kajabi doesn't have maybe as many options or as many features, but the feeling is different. Does that make sense? I hope that makes sense. That's just kind of how it felt in my head and in my own experience. So I just wanted to get this experience comparison review out to you guys as fast as possible because Kajabi has some phenomenal sales and deals going on right now. So if, if you're in this time of deciding if you want to switch upgrade programs, um, test something else out, see if you like it better, if you're ready to upgrade your membership platform, uh, then now is a great time to do it. Test the different free trials. Check them out, see what you think. Um, you know, Kartra and ClickFunnels, I think, have more options for digital product or for, uh, for physical products. 
and maybe um, e-commerce, stuff like that. Kajabi's really main focus, their flagship thing is membership course. So it's that online class platform. And I think hands down, it is the most elegant, um, beautiful, seamless, smooth, works every time, looks amazing platform for membership courses. And they're constantly, constantly, I really mean that, um, upgrading and adding new features and wanting to grow and, and, and change different things, which is really cool, but they have nailed their flagship product of offering the best top performing membership course platform site. So really, if you haven't checked it out yet, I so highly recommend that you do, um, but really test them all, try them all. They all have free trials. See which one, when you go on there and you move around, which one looks like it's going to be the best option for you, for your voice, for your branding, and for your style. So if this was helpful, uh, which I, I hope it was, again, it's really just my opinion from my experience on, on testing these different things uh, from my you know specific perspective, uh, go ahead and click the link below. That will give you access to uh, Kajabi's incredible deals and sales and offers that they have right now and that extended trial, if that's still going on when you watch this. Um, which I hope it is because it's so helpful. They also have a 28 day program where they send you a, an amazing video every single day, uh, walking you through how to create your first funnels, um, specifically designed to help you make like your first thousand dollars online. You know, if you're new to it, it's just such, such an easy way to get into that. I wish I had had this a year and a half ago, uh, would have made my life so much easier and so much less hair pulling, which would have been very exciting, but I can't go back in time and change that. So I'll just be excited for it now. So please go ahead, click the link below and uh, try out your memberships. All right. I hope that was helpful. Thanks.